I think when you talk about movements, uh, you got your fundamental basic movements, your run, jump, uh, throw, kick, catch, uh, strike. You know, those are your basic fundamental movements. Uh, and then as you get into and and then. After progression, now you start adding in the ABCs uh, of movement, which is your agility, balance, coordination, uh, and speed. Uh, those are sort of what we call the fundamental basics, the fundamental movement skills that a kid needs to acquire uh, during their window trainability, usually between the ages of, I would say, four to seven, four to eight uh, years old, uh, in order to allow them to build that confidence to succeed. Um, those are all things that need to be incorporated uh, into. Um, any programming, and I think that's a, a big part. Uh, what you see a lot of times with basketball programs is that coaches get so excited, they jump into the, the you know uh, the gym, uh, and they just start getting kids playing basketball. You know, but what happens is, well, the kids haven't really learned the basic movement skills yet. So you see, you know, the kids are not, uh, uh, you know, are ready for that. And, you know, as, and, and they're, and what happens is, you know, that's fine and all. They'll dabble in the sport, but they'll get to a certain point where they'll either plateau or they haven't, you know, to get overused injuries or they'll kind of just burn out. Um, uh, I'm actually sort of a perfect example of that. Uh, when I was younger, I never really did have a chance to develop a movement skills because, uh, you know, a, a, lot, a big part of my childhood was just on academics. It's a big part of my childhood was just on, um, you know, just uh, doing a lot of uh, school stuff, but I never really got into sports until later. So I was a bit of a late boomer. Uh, but, you know, as I get into sports, you know, around 10, 11 years old, um, you know, I, I've already noticed I'm, I'm, I'm definitely not fast. I'm definitely not as agile. Uh, I definitely don't jump very high like some of the other uh, kids around my age. Uh, and that's because I never had a chance to develop those uh, movement skills at an early age. Uh, and, and that's a big part. And that's a big part of what we preach uh, here in Canada is that, hey, you know what? Let's develop these guys. Let's develop uh, these participants and athletes uh, to make sure that they are our athletes first and, and then have them develop those basic skills and then move from there uh, to develop the sports skills. Uh, that will give them a total package uh, in terms of what an athlete should do.